Dear friends, today's uh, devotion is taken from Matthew chapter 11 verses 28 and 29. Let me read it for you. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Verse 29 says, Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. Dear friends, within these verses, we see Jesus making both an invitation and an offer. Those who heed his invitation and take up his offer will receive rest and peace in return. For all of us, daily transactions take place without us thinking too much about it. Although cash or purchase transactions seems to be the most obvious, we also do things for our loved ones as part of our love transaction. We do this for our loved ones, often expecting nothing in return, simply because we love them and we wish well for them. So Jesus too is offering this transaction based on his great love upon us. Because Jesus loves us, he doesn't want us to, want us to be encumbered with a heavy laden life, as he has personally carried all the heavy lifting for us at the cross. He has already carried our sins, our guilt, our failures, our hopelessness, and all other burdens that may come upon us on a daily basis. Instead of struggling alone, Jesus wants us to take up his yoke instead and learn from him how to live an unburdened life which brings rest and peace in our spirits. But I would like to ask, where and how does this transaction happen? Now, this transaction happens during our daily and consistent quiet time with him as we worship him, as we wait upon his presence and drink deep from his uh, word in scripture uh, every morning we unburden everything upon him and we cast our burdens upon him and instead receive new strength and courage to face new day may i ask you do you really enjoy waiting upon him every morning will you willingly give him your burdens every morning so that you may find rest and respite for our tired souls will you make the loving transaction let me pray Father God, we thank you that you take our burdens and give us your peace instead. And we pray, Father, that every morning when we come to you, we will do this transaction, that we will willingly give you our burdens, our guilt, our things that weigh heavily upon us. And instead, Lord, take your rest and your peace. Thank you, Lord, for your words of scripture. In Jesus' name we ask and pray. Amen. 